Hello, living like a boss here, and uh, this is June 21 of 22, and we are looking at the uh, best looking part of the old Minneapolis Moline Z. I just uh, worked this morning on my R, and I got the governor linkage all figured out there, got that running, and uh, ended up having to take the tank off, flush it off, you know, because it was just purely full of crap, and whatnot so we got that figured out got the our park below but now we're working on the Z which is a similar tractor this is uh, 206 cubic inch I don't know if you can see that on the camera and the R is uh, 165 I believe a little bit bigger engine here uh, same same situation side valve if you ever heard of such a design no actual uh, oil pan below it's all a solid cast block right up to here these are the two uh, number three and four cylinders number one and two over here their heads or blocks or whatever you want to call them and they're full of water Kind of totally seized up. I'm gonna have to break it apart, pull them apart, probably hammer out the pistons. I don't know what's gonna have to go on there, but uh, we'll get her done. These are interesting uh, machines here. I believe this is a 1941 model, the same as the VR. You got the uh, long ass uh, rockers here they're like a foot long camshaft runs in this area here or right here actually along with the water jacket but these rockers are like freaking huge like the span and uh, looks like here I don't know what's going on here got this here piece of metal in there it looks like some busted up piece of uh, uh, fold over lock squatch 253 would really appreciate a fold over lock but I don't believe that it belongs there I've never seen one in there I just opened up this before or first time and this one here has another piece of metal I'm just noticing they should just be just pray uh, the same as any adjustment like a flat screwdriver with a set nut that's all it is. They don't need this here extra metal. I don't know what's that, what is that. So find out what's going on there when I get a little deeper. You can tell somebody else has been doing some mechanicing work in here. You get the blue silicone, not, you know, and paper. I, I believe that's actually paper. It's not really gas material. It's silicone and paper. So I guess it worked for the time. So that's what we're up to today. I'm going to have to finish knocking that apart. And uh, hopefully we'll have it running here by, well, no guarantee. It's not going to be to buy, by tomorrow, but uh, we'll have it running pretty soon. But anyway, that's what I'm up to for the solstice uh, day. I guess it's the day after, but uh, we'll catch up to you later.